a seeker is an investigator. If there is no investigation, there is no seeker. A seeker doesn't take things for granted. A seeker lifts the rocks to see what's under them. Are you a seeker? Or are you someone who just accepts things on face value? Like most of the population. A seeker wants to investigate, wants to know how it all works, has an interest in that, doesn't accept what's been told, doesn't buy the belief systems. Are you an investigator? And of course, the greatest investigation isn't external, it's internal. What is your mind up to? How does it work? Why does it do what it does? What belief systems does it have? What defense systems does it have? Why does it have those defense systems? How do they work? If you are not an investigator, you are not a seeker. It's that simple. The true rebellion is the rebellion against your own mind that has been programmed by other people. But if you don't rebel, it doesn't happen. And if there's no investigation, there is not going to be a rebellion. You are just going to buy everything that's put in your head as true. And I assure you, it is not. If you believe your own mind, you're lost. because you are programmed by people who don't know themselves. And those programs are now yours. The lost leading the lost. Any questions? Any statements? Any challenges to this teaching this evening?